Hello, and welcome to my first match of the Renaissance Mixed Tournament here against Sporting Elijah. As hosted by Tracer. This is my first match in the initial phase where we play three other opponents in four game matches and then if you do well enough there you progress to a middle phase we're not straight to bracket this time we go to a middle phase which is a group phase against little groups you play a couple other people and then again it's sort of a round robin into then into a single limb bracket but with only four people so a uh, bit of a different format we'll see how it goes this board has not a great um well i guess it works You can either go gear and venner or gear silver. I guess you could do double gear as well. Um, this is like definitely an inventor board. Um, the villages are a little, I'm trying to think about whether you, maybe you don't muck around with city quarter much at all. So there may be turns where you have money that you're pretty okay with doing it. Um, certainly Inventor is the key here. You can do Recruiter to get a lot of village effects, but you're going to have to feed it. So you're going to have to like gain golds or trash other fives to it. Um, quite a bit. If you don't, I mean, it's either city, city quarter or recruiter, right? Those are that's it. That's the only game in town there. Um, how much? You mix of each. I'm not clear on yet. <clears throat> Silver is fine. Okay, this is bad. <laughs> this is quite bad. Um, you probably can make it work okay-ish. Survive anyway. We didn't hit five, we didn't see the gears. Um, but, you know. Not, we're not hitting our draw cards at the top of the shuffle so far. That's not been in the works. We're pretty far behind, though I will say that there's probably enough play here that it's not like game over. Um, they could still mess it up, I would say. I think you just go ahead and buy an inventor. Don't like the city quarter, so that's promising at least. Um, I have to think about whether I get a second recruiter versus an inventor. We're gonna trigger a shovel here. This one's not clear to me. Um, I like definitely need an inventor now.
Mm, that's interesting. Maybe it's correct to just keep. <clears throat> buying that stuff. Um. This is, of course, a bit awkward. They get thin very quickly. Though, of course, they're very thin as well. Um... They have two villages, so they are going to be able to play. <clears throat> They're inventors. They probably won't be able to buy anything. Um, I'm not going to have villages really. The problem. You can buy a gold. But it's pretty questionable. I mean, it's a, I guess it's, again, it's all relative to. Uh, oh, I do have some village effects still. Um, I think I will take one city quarter. <clears throat> it's a bit tough. You probably can get away with trashing a recruiter. I don't like the Sears. I don't think you need that. Um, or rather, I mean, maybe it's fine. I think you just need, want the inventors mostly. So they didn't add any inventoring there. Which isn't ideal. IMO. One, two. I can get, the, I can win the split on the inventors, which is okay. Um. Far as that all goes, I don't mind that. They can't actually gain provinces with them. They don't have enough. So 
So that's cool. <clears throat> um, and we're also not that close to a pile out. Um, just because of what, where the piles are. And I don't have to lower anything. Now, that all being said, there's a real chance. Okay, this is all right. Um, this is more than all right, truly. Um, I guess they can do duplicate stuff, potentially. This is um, a bit unfortunate to bottom deck the, what you would call it, but. I don't really want to lower the point of pile out. But we're still quite a ways from that. Okay. Maybe my province was bad. Promise was probably pretty bad. It probably should have just been like in the swashbuckler or something. Um, we can do a little bit of duplicates, but again, not this turn. They're not going to have $10. They just aren't going to have that money. So as long as they keep going into debt, what they can do is, is somewhat limited. And they also only got four villagers out of that. So that wasn't so great. Um. Maybe I want the pile slower. Right now I have points lead in the gains advantage, so that's something. <clears throat> they could get to 10, so they could play, they could gain four so provinces here. They didn't get the gold, so they can't actually. Um, they got the gold. This would have been a little scarier. But the duplicates are nice. Get the duplicates down. <clears throat> they need to... Well, they have to either gain some money... During their turn, or they could have gone quad province, or they could have gone five province. No, 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 they wouldn't have had that duplicate. So not quite that, but um, trash the seer. I 
I guess I should probably just try and get as many provinces as I can here. Which this is not a great draw for it. <clears throat> is all my silver right? Gonna live and die by where this uh city quarter is. The city quarter is in the bottom, then we can just win, I think. We're pretty close to it. This is trouble, though. A little bit. I mean, if they draw and they can do the do, I mean, what can we do here? We can, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, we can do seven gains. That's not going to cut it. I probably need them to dud. I mean, what? I can. I could have triple province, I guess, or quad province. I could have quad province. That might have been actually good. I get it down to eight. All right, get them down to three, and then I need seven dollars. Maybe I should quad province. Or go max. I'll see if they go max points here. Let's see if they let me in. Trash. I gotta think. What do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six. But I don't have enough actions if I do that, so it doesn't... That doesn't work either, right? <clears throat> um, I could do an inventor, but then I'm getting... No, that just doesn't work. It just doesn't work. You can get it down to three, but then I'm four or in debt. Don't have enough villages. So it sure doesn't work. Yeah, we'll just do it like this. We're just going to have to go for another turn, unfortunately. They have eight, nine gains. They already have enough... Gains to win. So if they draw, we just lose pretty much. Well, not pretty much. We just straight up do lose. And what if we go max duchy gain here? Wow, 
five gives us one, two. We can get to three duchies, three provinces. Uh, four duchies, three provinces. Does that lose to five? That's going to lose to five, isn't it? I mean, it doesn't strictly lose to five, but they'll do more than five. I think. Um, yeah, I mean, they'll be able to pick up a loose duchy somewhere. Yeah, we just got to go for, unfortunately. Unfortunately doesn't work We may not even draw in here, even though we added all this stuff. Probably we don't get another turn, to be honest. They're playing this in the wrong order. So I'll give them the undo if they ask for it. Uh, but they are playing this in the wrong order because they need a trash of gold first. I assume I assume they need the actions. Um, maybe they'll still have enough. They have quite a few uh, city quarters, so maybe they still have enough regardless. But um, you should uh, you should have. Well, they still need the money, right? Well, maybe they just pile out. Maybe I needed to score a little bit to prevent a pile out. So then maybe they just empty the duchies. Oh, they had money. They didn't need the money because they didn't keep the debt that time. I was pretty close to having... Um, I was pretty close to being able to do like five provinces, which would have been a little bit awkward, I think, for them to beat there, though probably they beat that too. It would have been more than five provinces too. It would have been like f three duchy, five province, something like that. Um, two du probably like two Dutch five. We didn't quite get the draws to make it all happen though, so um, that's just the way it went. <clears throat> oh. The classic. All right, so groom, research, patron, a few different things. I don't know. Probably a. Seer thing should be quite good here. <coughs> so 
does it reveal? Yeah, Seer should be quite good here. <clears throat> Crop rotation would be nice to pick up. Um... I would like to try and trash. My shuffle is a little better than theirs. I think. Not like super clear what shuffles are best here, but. This was all a little unfortunate. Really would like to buy a seer. <laughs> um, but even just patron with <clears throat> training on it is pretty good. See if they take crop rotation or not. You don't want to delay your green too long here. There's not. I guess capital is good enough buy. It's a bit awkward. I don't even know, like maybe you just gun gun for it. Maybe you just try and green. The trashing is so slow. The draw is really slow here, actually. Um I mean, you can get crop rotation or whatever. Or you can just train your patrons and go for it. Um, then they have to try, I mean, they do have a couple sears, but no copper trashing, so. When, did I try, see my estates yet, this shuffle? It's a bit awkward. They do have the Sears, but they don't have much anything else. It's not, I guess, saying a whole lot, but I would have loved it. My bottom deck Sears, so I didn't get that, but. <clears throat> Yeah. <clears throat> 
they just bought the patron, which is weird. That's not that. Not like that big a deal. I wouldn't say. I feel like I've overbuilt still, but. Let's see. Okay. Well, this wasn't so great. Would have been nice to hit the... I don't know why. Well, I need it. <clears throat> The supplies in the crop rotation work against each other a bit here. They didn't get to capital, so there's just single province in here. Well, they could go. They could draw their. They could have gotten a state and drawn it. I guess. Um, would have been maybe worth thinking about. Okay. Okay. This is good. This is double. Also, we can research groom. So we may not double again, but we'll at least get single. So we'll be up to we'll be up to five promises. I feel like you I think I overbuilt or I didn't either I, I, I midway between really building or you know, the little building. <clears throat> like if I when I double seer I should probably be like seer capital or something. Anyway, they can't double here. I mean they can, but they're gonna for sure lose, of course. There's literally just no missing for me. Yeah, that was a bit of a weird one. The board kind of looked more powerful than it 
Well, it could be that it, the building was kind of bad, but the board looked more powerful than it really ended up being. The gains were hard. <clears throat> Not the gains, the buys, I guess, were kind of awkward. Wasn't it really clear that grooming for all those patrons, like what exactly it was doing at some point, you know? Uh, so we have Inventor, but this time without really a village. So it you can't really you can play with inventor some but it's not not as you know exciting at all <clears throat> um with the village this board would be quite different but without a village it's a little more uh it's a little tougher to pick and choose your spots for your terminals You probably end up playing something that's more of a butcher money kind of thing. Um, would be my guess. <clears throat> and just try and play butcher pretty often with with border guards, and then get, gain some experiments. Maybe if you accumulate enough, uh, is border guard look at or reveal reveal? So maybe you do some patron stuff with border guard. Experiment's not so clear to me. I think it's probably fine. I kind of want to open what I would have liked to. I don't know about the... I don't know about the inventor. This is kind of unfortunate. Well, more than kind of, but... <coughs> they got a better draw than me. And a much better reshuffle as well, <laughs> frankly. I don't really know what they're doing. It still feels pretty money-ish to me, or that you want to do. Money, money-ish is not the right word for it, but <clears throat> I don't actually expect two inventors to be the play. Though for sure this um, shuffle has been a little sad. I just don't know what they're doing with the inventors. <laughs> I bottom deck the two estates here. Pretty unfortunate. We'll be able to shuffle, or I will be able to plot next turn, which is okay. Here's what I'll do. This isn't so clear that you do silver like this, or do this over. Actually, let's kill, it. Let's kill the silver, see if they'll let me do this. Let's kill silver to experiment and buy gold, though. <clears throat> and I'll pop the plot this turn. Not fully sure what they're doing still.
I'm gonna green pretty quickly. I don't wanna wait too long. This didn't really work out all that well. Well, I would have obviously loved to. Would have obviously loved to draw the butcher with a. <clears throat> We have a lot of stop cards. Well, I will for sure promise this turn. Hopefully we find an estate to get to butcher into a border guard. I assume they'll buy experiment, but city gate is looks pretty bad to me. They, don't, they haven't accumulated any villagers, so it's not like they're going to play two inventors do something exciting. Like, that's just not, not in the cards for them. They also don't have any coffers. I have extra villagers, though it doesn't matter. <laughs> see, see two provinces, okay. Um, I gotta think about what parity helps me here. As far as remaining provinces. Um... Lowering to two doesn't seem great. Did they get a little bit of copper? <clears throat> They take one here, I'll probably blow up the the plot and just see if we can get to the butcher. I know it's not like the best chances, but it seems like the thing to try anyway. Okay, we didn't get there. That hurts quite a bit, <laughs> as one might imagine. We should know more about what they have left. I think the issue is they do have golds down in there. They have a gold. They probably have some patrons. <clears throat> and they plot, right? Okay, so just plot blow up will definitely be sufficient. Um, surely you do that in the other order. Like, that can't be right. As far as plot versus city gate. <clears throat> I should be fine here. I'm like barely fine, but I am fine. Kind of barely fine, not really. Yeah, they just, they, they put in, I think, too many stop cards. I don't 
don't I don't like the double inventor at all. Now if that was like a groom, it would make more sense. You'd be getting horses out of it and stuff, but you're not using the cost reduction there at all. So I'm not sure what that what the intention is there. I mean unless you can unless you like <clears throat> The only thing I can imagine, and I don't think it works, but I can kind of imagine it, is like a discipline discipline thing where you play play patrons to accumulate villagers and then do a big plot, like gain experiments as you go along, try and get, but it just is so slow. And I don't think it, it can work. It just takes too long to play everything to make it happen. And then do like five, do like a five prom of it. Pardon me, a five province finish, ideally, something like that. But I just don't see it. Uh okay. I should click start game. So this board has donate, so the probably the cursing isn't so big, but the little witches also are like primary draw. Um <clears throat> There's gonna be some like fairly slick path here. Involving engineer and such. I have to imagine. But I don't know if you go like engineer into donate or, or, or what exactly you do. Because um, then you have basically a smithy. A smithy draw engine, you know. That's basically what's here. Buy, buy, and then draw, and then treasures. So it's not super duper. It's not clear at all to me the quickest way to kind of get to that that deck because it doesn't have to be. Doesn't have to be like the thinnest thing ever. <clears throat> this is really nice. Like if you go open treasure, yeah, this is like broken good. I'm probably winning. Um it's that good. Because you can take the key. I mean, I have to try and get to a treasure so I can take the key. So, but it's hard, right? Um, <clears throat> there are like some dream reshuffles for me that. Uh, this isn't that great we're getting good down to four I can pay off gain silver I mean I can gain two silvers even if I want um if I go down to three coppers and gain two silver I can on my next turn buy treasure I guess the question is if I want to do that versus any number of other things. The other option is to go Silver Workers Village. And then, so we'd pay off four, we'd go to one, and then we would have six. That could work too. We go Silver Workers Village, because I can't miss. I have four debt, and then we have one. It's just not as thin, of course. Um, it does give us the buy, though, which is pretty good here. The 
buy is pretty nice. Probably we rebuy an engineer pretty quickly. Now this is kind of a question, because this could go quite badly. What are, what are, what do we? We can bottom deck the workers' village. We can bottom deck anything now. In fact, we're gonna we're gonna have two cards, right? <clears throat> um. Engineer is good though. Okay, good shuffle. This isn't such an exciting deck that they have, in all honesty. Three, four, five, six, seven. So I can buy an experiment. Or something. Yeah, I feel okay. Money and draw. <laughs> I've got the gainer. I guess there's some point where I should figure out <clears throat> if the money gains them anything. It's very likely that the money gains them something there, is worth something to them there. Very, very likely. Two festivals. That's a lot of festivals. I don't really like the festivals very much. It's okay when you have um, like five cards or whatever, but more than one of them doesn't seem that good to me. I wonder if we should get a <clears throat> old witch. They buy an old witch. That's fine. Get another engineer. Okay. Yeah, I mean, engineer, very good card here. Um. What do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, one, two, three, four. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, I know what to buy. Oh, I kept the key. Well, I could trash. That's not so appealing, though, because I would like to do... Well, I could go, uh, it's, it's basically, if I trash, I get a festival over a gold. Then we go festival, old witch lackeys. 
Those are the questions. Um, rather than no, 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 that cost two. That cost two. This dude didn't do nothing. I liked the buys I came up with in my head. Pretty good. They're just here without, uh, they must have had a bad, I don't know if they bottom deck stuff. They must have, um, which, right, yeah. We'll just curse the, we'll just trash the curses later on. I might go for Mountain Pass. I gotta think. I may take a province because I have a lot more money than them. And it may be a little awkward for them. They keep, they keep buying, they keep buying the festivals. Okay, so we bought them decked uh, like copper lackeys, which is totally fine. How much money do I have? Only three, six, twelve, fourteen. Could be like old witch province. I think it's just awkward for them. I think that <clears throat> I should get a good deal. I mean, I'm just ahead, and that's sort of how Mountain Pass works. Bid 13. So, like, if I let them have it for 13 or for 12, how many turns? Out. For 13 is not so bad. I think I can just take it. I don't know. They're buying all these festivals, and they're just kind of crappy, frankly. It's not very much money. They do have the two engineers, which is pretty nice. <clears throat> I don't know, will we get a pile out? This was a bad draw for me. Um... Pretty bad draw anyway. One, two, three, four, five, nine, thirteen. Do we want to buy another engineer? <clears throat> we bought them decked like four workers, well, not four, but three, two or three workers' villages and the engineer. Um. Hopefully we see, if we don't see, well, we'll have to buy lackeys, basically. If we don't see, um, 
If we don't see one of the uh, draw cards or three cards, we'll have to buy laggings. Or gain them anyway. <clears throat> Hopefully we just see some draw off this. Otherwise the turn could get quite bad. We just have to spend a turn buying lackeys. This is all okay, in my opinion. I mean, I think their gains are reasonable. I just mean I think it's okay for me. Okay, so that was quite bad. We have six. Um, but we're still okay. We've got the points. We probably need to double lackeys. We need at least one, but we've got to get through. There's one worker's village. We just need both of them. Now we're going to have a terminal problem in general, but... Maybe it's still okay. Hopefully, we just get to a point here where we're like, maybe they can double and I can double, but we have the the points lead. Maybe it won't be safe. I'm not sure. Maybe they're piling out. I don't know. That's a little scary as an idea. They maybe are just piling out. <clears throat> um if they don't pile out I probably can. Do they still have they still have their maybe just went They may just, I don't know how much money they have exactly and how much they need. They can do, there would be three lackeys left, so they would need 14 and then, oh, but they have to empty the curses, so that would be points. They would need a lot more money than they have. They can go workers with those lackeys, but then there's still three lackeys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's not. Now, on my turn... I'm for sure emptying the cur well not for sure but pretty much for sure emptying the curses and then Now, I don't know that I'll be able to pile if they, like, double province. Um, they'll only have 16 points, so depends on... No, no, I think if I draw enough stuff, it'll work. They are kind of giving up their pile-out ability. Maybe they had to do this to be able to double... They don't have any engineers now, 
So they're kind of giving up their pile out options. Um, so even if here they do something probably okay I don't know how much money they have exactly but this isn't an especially compelling play in fact the lackeys buy is just makes it even easier for me um, I can of course still just whiff on drawing my uh, engineer but I didn't um, Okay, so we got out with 3-1. That one got a little scary. Uh, I uh, wish I had won that first game. I had a decent shot, shot after I won the in Inventor split, but uh, bottom deck thing. I mean, I was not as trash as they were, so it was like not weird that I bottom deck some stuff, but there was some shuffle where I get out with the win but anyway thank you all for watching hope you enjoyed it and i will see you later for more renaissance mix